वेलकम टू माई चैनल कंवल सिद्धु अ चैनल फॉर बी बी ए बी कॉम एम बी ए एंड एम कॉम लेक्चर्स इन टूडेज लेक्चर सेशन वी विल डिस्कस द कंसेप्ट ऑफ रेफरेंस ग्रुप वी विल ऑल्सो डिस्कस हाउ द मार्केटर्स यूज दिस कंसेप्ट इन इन्फ्लुएंसिंग एंड अट्रैक्टिंग कंज्यूमर्स टूवर्ड्स देयर पर्टिकुलर प्रोडक्ट्स सो फॉर ईजी एंड सिंपल लेक्चर सेशन डू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल we can define the term reference group as an actual imaginary individual group or an institution that uh, influences the consumer behavior then we can say that reference group also plays an important role in influencing the consumer opinion belief attitude and behavior it is also not important that uh, consumer has to be member of a reference group that influences his behavior the family Uh, the friend group can be a reference group for any person similarly any sports team or a club like manchester united or uh, liverpool can also be a reference group for, for any other person the main reasons for joining a particular reference group can be the information benefits so in this case con consumer joins a particular group to enhance his knowledge or to gain any kind of information if joining some group will also result in some kind of rewards then also people follow that group and uh, at last the reference group also provide a platform where a person or a consumer can express his thoughts and expressions with others we can divide the reference groups into two basic types the first is the normative reference group which directly influence the consumers or the person's attitude and values uh, the example of this kind of reference group can be parents the family members the teachers who influence the behavior of a person or a consumer directly and the second is the comparative reference group to which the individual does not belong but use it as a standard for self evaluation so this type of reference group is also known as the reference point the sports persons the film stars and other celebrities are example of the comparative reference group a person joins any reference group due to certain powers that are possessed by that group the power of a reference group attracts consumers or people towards it the power can be a referent power in this case the person admires the qualities of a person or a group and try to follow them the most common example are the film stars and other celebrities to whom people refer and copy them then is the information power in this case people join any particular group to gain some knowledge and information then there are formal groups which have legitimate power then some people are expert in their fields they possess expert power and people follow them due to that power then there are groups who provide reinforcement to the people the group offers reward to the people who are part of that uh, reference group or people or consumers who follow them so in this case the power possessed by a reference group is uh, referred to as the reward power then finally the reference group also have coercive powers which uh, mainly influence the group members by force the coercive power has a uh, ability to give threats or to withhold the rewards however this kind of uh, reference group power is not uh, mostly or commonly used in case of marketing and advertising activities so these are the powers of the reference group now let's discuss another important topic related to reference group that is consumer related reference group as we know that each person or a consumer is influenced by a diverse range of people that they come in contact with so there are basically seven main types of consumer related reference group the first are the friendship group the consumers enjoy the company of their friends while purchasing certain products and uh, friends mostly influence the consumers in clothing jewelry cosmetics watching movies etc the second are the shopping group or we call it uh, purchase pals 
दे आर दी पीपल हु कंपनी दी कंज्यूमर्स फॉर शॉपिंग एंड दी परचेज पर्ल्स हैव अ नॉलेज अबाउट दी प्रोडक्ट एंड दे इन्फ्लुएंस दी कंज्यूमर बाइंग डिसीजंस फॉर एग्जांपल वाइल परचेजिंग एनी व्हीकल और अ हाउस वी यूजुअली टेक अलोंग अ पर्सन हु हैज अ कंप्लीट नॉलेज अबाउट दैट पर्टिकुलर व्हीकल और अ हाउस then next are the work groups which include the people working in a same organizations there are the formal work groups which have the people working in a same department or a team and informal work groups that mostly comprise of the people who have become friends irrespective of their team or department then as we know that social media has become an important part of everyone's life and people mostly use this social media platform to express their views they join common communities and such reference groups are known as the virtual groups or virtual communities then there are brand communities which has people using a particular brand the famous harley group is is an example of uh, this kind of brand community the group members of this uh, harley group have a same brand bike and clothing and in order to promote this group the company has launched the range of cl- clothing accessories and even crockery items then there are consumer action groups which are working to support the common cause the best example of consumer action group can be various social organizations who work for providing social benefits to the community or the population and uh, they have a great influence on the buying behavior of the consumers the last are the associate or disassociate groups the marketers use the aspiration as a means of influencing the consumer behavior in this case when a consumer buys certain product he becomes a member of that aspirational group the luxury items are often marketed by this process then the disassociate group are totally opposite of the aspirational group the consumers always try to disassociate them uh, from the disassociate groups as they do not match uh, this kind of behavior that is uh, mostly uh, of the people of that particular group now finally discuss how the marketers use this concept of reference group these are the major types of reference group appeals that are used by the marketers the most important are the celebrities that includes the film stars and the sports persons the consumers easily relate their life and attitude with the celebrities next are the experts who have a complete knowledge about a particular thing like uh, we have seen the sports stars or the sports people often write sports related columns and are part of different sports related groups and discussions then is the common man appeal so the common man appeal will mostly feature a person with whom most of the consumers will relate the marketers nowadays use common man appeal to attract and influence the consumers then most of the business organizations are using their top executives as the spokespersons in consumer related advertisements so these ads reflect that even the top executive of the company has a complete knowledge about the problems faced by the consumer then the last are the spoke characters so these are the fictional characters that are used by the companies to influence the consumers the best example are the ronald of mcdonald's onidas devil and a girl of amul so this was all in today's uh, lecture session related to reference group and these are some of the examples of spoke characters which are used by the marketers to influence and attract the consumers thanks